Hi and welcome. My name is Chavo and we're playing Atomy Heart. So we've got all of the schematics here. And I understand that we must. No! Finally. So now we are going where we need. Ooh, that's a lot. Which polygon do I need to go? Uh, tenth? Okay, we are going here and then we will see. Stuck somewhere again. Finally. Hey, you. Do we have anything else in here? Oh, we're going that way. We must go that way. But... How am I supposed to go that way? I think that may be there. Thank you, thank you. They're still repairing it, right? Whoa! that they will not fight back no I cannot <laughs> okay that's interesting we opened it like a I know, okay, let's continue. No, let's continue. Yep, thank you. Hello. Look what we have here. What the hell? You killed him. That's enough, Victor. So much death. 
I just knocked him out. He's unconscious, okay? To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against the sea of troubles, and by opposing in them. No, it's, it's all wrong. It's all wrong. I don't agree. I'm sorry, Larissa, but I don't understand. He ruined everything, and you, you! I'm a doctor. Enough people have died today. People, Larissa! He's an animal! He'll rip anybody's throat out of such enough orders him to! Victor, he's tied up. I'll program a treatment and then we'll go. Go where? No one's coming for us. And this fucking lunatic's ruined our escape plan! I know. We'll come up with something. I doubt it. <laughs> Just let me go, and I promise I'll make it quick. <laughs> And painless. So Svechinov's talk and talk, huh? Look, he just came to and he's already threatening us! <laughs> yeah, I am threatening you. How many people have your robots slaughtered without so much as a warning? Petrov? Two thousand? Three thousand? That's 000? not Victor's fault. It was a local <sighs> malfunction. A local malfunction? Then why the shit doesn't your boyfriend have a scratch on him, huh? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Isn't it obvious? First Vavilov, then the VDNH. The robots are attacking everyone except you two. Why is that if you're not controlling them? <laughs> Victor, you said you had nothing to do with this. <laughs> and you believed him. What other bullshit has this guy told you? <laughs> oh, man. Victor. I had no choice. A simple malfunction wouldn't have changed anything. How could you? Huh? How could I? You said it yourself, the whole world might end. No, don't touch me. <laughs> you really didn't tell her anything, did you? <laughs> A big mistake. Hey, what the hell? Uh, Larissa, wait! Larissa! Nothing can save you now, asshole. And oh, this thing can help. I thought that they at least tell him something to hesitate to our guy. I mean, but no. P3 to Chelome. Petrov got away again. You seem to enjoy chasing the man, Nechayev. Petrov must not interfere with the launch of Collective. Find the criminal. Now. Secret you have message. drawn the wizard's ire, Comrade Major. No shit. Get off my grill, will ya? Comrade Schnipperson, thank you for a message about the, your vital discovery regarding the potential radio free transmission of a signal via the vibrational structure of the polymer. Please read the following message slowly and carefully. There is currently no need to continue exploring this possibility of transmitting signals between polymer structures. Nor is there any need to publish any opinions or thoughts on the matter. To put it bluntly, you are prohibited from studying, utilizing or discussing the discovery you have made with anyone whatsoever. That being said, for your brilliant observation and passion for science, I have requested that you be promoted next month and transfer it to my personal research team. Sincerely, D. Ants. So it was such enough. Okay, that's interesting. That's <sighs> in style. Why not? It will be more powerful that way. 
Oh, we must go somewhere really far. Um, it's somewhere here again. So so far. Testing ground ten. Bad boy, dominator. High intensity ventilators. MP columnator. Ooh, I definitely need to go there. There's a extended magazine for collage. Already free, Major? Oh, what, did you not expect to hear from me? Not only can I hear you just fine, I'm gonna see you real soon, too. So get ready, prick. Trust me, the preparations are well underway. There will be surprises, <laughs> dog. You turned Larissa against me, bitch. She Return my calls. Yeah, you're breaking my heart. I don't give two wet farts about your relationship. Charles, can you trace the call? Where is that shit stain? The signal's coming from the Plisetskaya Theater. A theater? Right here in the facility? <laughs> what a clown. It's a theater, comrade major, not a circus. Marking the waypoint. Whatever. I won't let that traitor get away from me again. Where am I? Oh, there am I. It all connected to... It's all connected to... Hi guys. Okay, now I understand. So this is con this connected to everything. Will you go here? Attention, Major. Things are about to get ugly. Whoa. What the hell?
What's happening? Okay. this guys bye bye power load That's enough. So now I can go. I didn't know that it will work like that. There's a lot of these parts. Hey, those guys, too many, too many. Oh, I have this uh, powers. I need to use them more frequently. I'm always forgetting about them. Like, and they're like pretty, okay. Sp uh, except of shock, everything else is pretty easy to use. Q and E. Uh, sorry. Hmm. I didn't see that his hand is so hairy. How deep it is. Um, you need to fix the lights in here. Wait, they have robots and everything, but they're still this bulbs. Oh, every single testing ground has a damn pigsty for an entrance. I should mention that rank and file employees commute to work via the cable car system, which, as you may have noticed, is currently out of service. Kinda reminds me of the metro. Authorization. Make. Okay. No. Please select the desired procedure. Oh, that's a lot. Shock, character. Increase your maximum health. Definitely. Your excellent maximum skills increase the accuracy of your unaimed shooting. Yeah. Awesome. And shield you from 
all damage while dodging, using medical supplies allows you to fully regenerate health in a matter of seconds. Okay. 242. I will wait then. I have one small. Yeah, I used a lot of healing items there. Bio materials. Shotgun rounds. Huh? How am I supposed to get there? Hey, what the hell? I don't want to go up. Hey! Ah, perfect. Now I need Please to use the this. Desired procedure. <sighs> Call him a jet. Use polymer to enhance the effect of freezing fire and electricity. Why polymer? Okay. Don't know how to use I use it, but What the hell? Whew, did it. It works pretty fast, uh, pretty long. Thank you. Really hate it. But still, thank you.
Okay. At least. Yeah. Apparently. Flat line. <sighs> okay. I hope that I am not too far from this moment. Petrov got away. What Again. the hell? You seem to enjoy chasing the man, Nachayev. So we're back finally. Oof. That was something. Oh. That's what we need to do. No! Thank you. I thought I will die again. Thank you. Thank you. first one what it will be nice ah, extended magazine If there was a possibility to make it hmm, interesting. Okay. 
So I don't need this one. Thank you. Let's wait. Wait, what? Somehow. Nice. Oh. Hmm. Nice. Authorization. So. Oh. Upgrade for Clash. Extended magazine. Nice. Just, just go. Upgrade. Increase aiming speed. How? Extend the magazine even more. Increased reload speed. Barrel. Aiming speed. Reduce recoil. Eh, let's continue. So now we have 61. Awesome. To facilitate the safe international shipping of robots to allied nations, Facility 3826 has developed the Sepoy Extra Strong Heavy Duty Waterproof Maritime Shipping Container. Constructed out of high quality corrugated metal, the container is treated with Type M PTA5, a special non magnetic alloy with zero permeability. This property minimizes the risk of. Whoa! What the hell?
Okay. I used a lot of my flash ammo. But we still can proceed. Okay, these guys with sticks are a lot more powerful than the previous. That's not it. Ah. Oof. Didn't know that in there were, like before that in this testing grounds was nothing. Oh god, okay. And the last one after everything we've got like a mid boss fight. Dig it! Ah, there you okay. are. Okay, let's crack this fucker open. So, PM collimator. That's what I need. So, what will it be, Major? It will be upgrade again. Uh, magazine collimator. Yep. Awesome. Now it's a lot easier to aim. And it doesn't need any other... Ooh, extend magazine. Increased reload speed. Increased damage to organics. Ooh. I've got that one right last time, right? Yeah. Barrel case. Increased damage. Okay, more damage. Really good. Increase rate of fire. Increase weak point damage. And increase charge damage. Nah, don't need it. But now we have. I forget about that. That we've got a barrel. That's definitely awesome. Can you jump? No, you cannot. Awesome. That's what I need.
Listen, you're still a pain in the dick, but everything else aside, I want to say thanks. thank you. You really have been useful. I'd have lost my marbles here by myself. The feeling is Bad boy. I could never have done this without you. you and mean, indeed, you are my battery. Don't uh, either. Uh, get out of here. Not hey, without hey, you, hey. comrade major. Okay, this is definitely an awesome weapon now. Different barrel. Yeah. Okay, okay. We can continue. I hope that they still... Oh, sorry. Um, they still didn't get their electricity... Their connection back. I'm curious what this means on the left side. I think it will be awesome to fight it with this gun. Yep. Are we there? Hello. Let's go. Sorry, guys. Guys, don't follow me. Uh, let's see. Okay, they didn't see me. How'd that whacked out psycho Petrov manage to reprogram civilian robots to kill people? As I mentioned earlier, okay. Victor Petrov is a talented engineer and programmer. Why didn't he use his talents to help people? Okay. It's there. Do I get there? Nope. No 
Wait, it asked me. That's awesome. Go up. supposed to go there. Oh. It actually works. Ah, uh, where am I? So... was here, right? Testing ground two. So it's somewhere in here. Another testing ground. So we must run there. Uh, expansive converter. Expansive. Electromagnetic polarizer. Thermal imager. And for snowball something. Electromagnetic polarizer. I don't know if I need it. Where was it? <clears throat> Don't understand. I was here, looking that way. Ah, there you are. That's the easiest way. Just destroy. Destroy it and you don't need to deal with them. Again. Bye bye guys. And we have open... This thing, right? Access granted. Uh, no, uh, leave. Another testing ground. Yeah, this this one really worth it. Hmm. So now it's just charged. Ah, uh, now I understand. The charged uh, shot consumes four bullets. We must remember that. I 
I really hate how deep we must go. And how long it takes. Thirty-four. What's that supposed to mean? Nine, five, thirty-four. Moving. So, um... Another testing ground, another new weapon. Indeed. I thought Facility 3826 was all about civilian science. You know, exploring outer space, increasing crop yield, and all that jazz. This is a complex undertaking. Consider this. The facility is Dr. Sechenov's fiefdom. It is equal parts, mobile telephones, high-yield apple trees, and lethal weaponry. What's your point? Could it be that your boss isn't the messiah you think he is? Shut your speaker. Yeah. Don't talk too much. Who made this dummies look like that? Hmm. Interesting. Anything in here? Who made them? Why they're rotating? The doll R9, full-scale anthropomorphic test dummy, is designed for experimental research into the effects of collision and trauma on a living human body. A doll is not merely an inanimate body double, but an intricate polymer device equipped with an array of electronic sensors connected to data collection hub. These sensors allow us to monitor exactly what happens to the dummy during potentially lethal experiments. So what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Don't understand how it must look like. Doesn't work. Oh, there are also magnetic things. Okay, I cannot go through here. Hey!
Oh. That's why it must look like that. Yeah, I think that's okay. PM electromagnetic polarizer. Access granted. Why not? Upgrade. Barrel case. Electromagnetic polar polarizer. Yeah, for sure. So what's next? Uh, increase rate of fire. Increase accuracy recoil. Reduce recoil, increase damage, maximum damage, and adds the ability to stun robots. Totally worth it. Increase your reload speed. Yeah, like it's almost increased charge damage. Well, let's go. Now it's like really good weapon. you see? They are there. What is happening here? What's that? What was that? There was a boss card. Or a brief. That was strange. Soviet and foreign scientists have proven that over the course of this planet's existence, its magnetic north and south have often changed places. Theoretically, the same can happen in our lifetime too. In fact, it could happen at any moment. And yet, the effects of such natural disasters are difficult to predict. This is why scientists at Testing Ground 2 are doing their best to emulate the conditions of a bygone era and recreate the exact appearance of our planet during the last geomagnetic reversal 42,000 years ago. Okay. Let's go. Perfect. Just perfect. Really? 
so they can actually kill me. Okay, it's good that I have a... No! He died. Is there any reason for that one? This is a shortcut. Nice. Okay. What am I supposed to do here? If it doesn't work that way. We can do this.
That's it. <sighs> yeah, this is long. And almost only this test grounds. But I think that they're somehow important too. Hmm, second one. What's the second one is? Ooh. It can... Okay. That's something for a shotgun. Barrel. Expansive converter. Reduce recoil. Rate of fire. Increase damage. Two organics. Hmm. Damper polymeric stock. Okay, still not bad. Wait, where am I supposed to do? To go? Oh. Living on the surface of the Earth, we know what is up and what is down. But what would happen if gravity as we know it were taken away? Naturally, this poses a huge physical challenge for the human body. But what if we could adapt to live in zero gravity conditions? This is what this workshop is all about. Studying the possibility of having a comfortable, ordinary life in conditions that are abnormal for the human body. A Soviet citizen can adapt to any new lifestyle because they have science at their side. And science always serves the people. Okay, we're here. Finally, last one. Clash Thermal Scope. Okay, another end inside the testing room. Do I have something here? Not much. Oh, that one's still good. So let's save, and we will continue next time. We still have a little part of um, of a story. Uh, now we actually finally understand that while we're going uh, on a story mission, like main missions, uh, we still going through this testing grounds and we must it's not like we must but it like it's really good to have this upgrade so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed smash like if you did leave your comments and subscribe see you next videos bye